Good afternoon. I am Nick, uh, the founder of DDust. I must notice it's much more than 200 people here. Thank you all uh, for joining us today. Today, we'll redefine Tone Defy. We'll create a before and after. Uh, but before we get there, let's take a moment to look back. Let's revisit the journey of DDAST. Two years ago, oops, two years ago, I, I launched the first version of DDAST. After months of hard work, this product, you, you've seen this product, and it was simple yet powerful, with simple but essential feature. It's simple, simple feature for other networks, but um, in Tone, Didas was the only DEX with auto wrapping of Tone. It's hard to imagine, but exactly this feature set us apart at that moment. Four months later, another developer joined it and we became a team of two. Together, we launched a new version. Our work was highly evaluated by the judges of Tone Foundation Hackathon. They called it game-changing. But what actually made it game-changing? Actually, two things. Uh, Multi-hop swaps and mesh architecture. Let's talk a bit uh, about multi-hop swaps. Let's imagine you have two pairs, Tone USDT and USDT BTC. You have Tone, but you want BTC. Without multi-hop swaps, it, it's a two-step process. You, you have to swap Tone to USDT, and then after receiving USDT, you swap it to BTC. Uh, with multi-hop swaps, it's different. You send a single transaction to swap your TON to BTC. Behind the scenes, of course, it swaps TON to USDT and then to BTC, but absolutely automatically and much more efficiently. No hassle, no extra steps, just sim simple and smooth user experience. Now let's talk about mesh architecture. Uh, most of the DEXs have a router. This router receives some assets, and after a while, it pays out other assets. This approach is commonly used by, by other networks. But here is the problem. Uh, in Tone, Tone actually has a different design, and in Tone, this setup becomes a bottleneck. If one token is traded heavily, uh, it stalls, the router stalls until it processes all the swaps. And the most, uh, the worst part is that every other asset gets stuck too. For example, a position in the lending protocol cannot be urgently liquidated because a DEX doesn't work. And this is a problem. Um, let's take a look how it works in DDoS. No any central contracts. We use vault instead. Each vault handles a single asset, meaning it operates independently without affecting other assets. And ima just imagine empowering this mesh architecture with multi-hop swaps. It's low, low cost, smooth transactions. It's, it's it's worked like a magic. Uh, and that's how it works. Now let's take a look at the timeline. Well, I think it's, it's a perfect time for the next evolution, but uh, the bar is set high and it should surpass it, otherwise it has no reasons for being. So what can be it next? Uh, possibly weighted pools? Well, weighted pools, it's too specialized a thing to be the foundation of the next version. 
So it's not, definitely not weighted pools. Maybe stable swaps? Well, uh, we've had them for one and a half a year. Of course, it can be improved, but it still is, is not enough to be the foundation of a new version. So not an option. Also, maybe concentrated liquidity. It's a good guess, but it's a very complicated thing. So during the last year, we got a lot of questions from different projects, each unit, each, each different. And we did our best to count them all. And actually, we succeeded. Now, I'm proud to introduce the next evolution. Bdust X. <laughs> Truly extensible protocol. Extreme extendability. Just imagine pools you may customize for your needs. It can be postpone, start, for launch paths, or dynamic fees on chain oracles, or entirely new types of pools, like weighted pools or concentrated liquidity pools, or some pools for meme paths. It's not just a protocol, it's a canvas for your ideas. And how it's really possible? Well, we take a solid foundation. It's a scalable protocol. It's battle tested. And we strip the weight, specific implementation like constant product or stable pools. Instead, we've built in TVM, allowing them, allowing pools to execute your code. But, and it's limitless, like, so, potential, and we will take care about the rest. We'll provide infrastructure, price feeds, smart routing API, so you can focus your ideas. Just imagine an ecosystem where you can focus on your application without spending days or weeks on adding some new DeFi features, existing features. So it's, it's going to be the beginning of something great. And one more thing, the community was in the heart of the dust from the very beginning. And now we would like to give back. We would like to empower all builders. Whatever you build, it can be development tools to make ecosystem more accessible, or it can be new types of pools, or you just support fellow developers. We're here to support you. So we have some extra prizes for the hackathon. And one extraordinary prize also for hackathon for concentrated liquidity implementation on top of the Dust X. And I'm excited to launch a closed beta test today. Simply scan QR code on the screen. Thank you for your attention.